on the bench this afternoon is an Arcam Alpha Plus CD player. These are virtually the same as the Arcam Alpha, but the Plus has black gate capacitors in it and very high end output capacitors here, the black capacitors you can see there. This one I bought for parts not working. There's already another video on YouTube over this and I've upgraded it as well. Um, so with this one, I replaced uh, some components on here to get it going because there was no output here. But also I've noticed that um, this is a bit selective in playing CDs. Um, it will play uh, this Supertramp one, which is uh, brand new. I've just bought this, uh, but it won't play my Sabrina Claudio CD, one of my favorite CDs I've got. And um, not many, actually not many players will play this one for some reason, I don't know why. Maybe Atlantic Records who produced this have put a different sort of coating on the CD. Anyway, I thought, okay, maybe the CDM4 in this is a bit tired. Um, but I had a look in the circuit diagram, or well, the service manual should I say, and I found out how to adjust um, adjust this, and uh, it's the focus, I believe it is. See the 4K7 trimmer there? Uh, you need to adjust that with um, a small Allen key here, and it is a 2, 2 mil Allen key goes in there to adjust that. What you need to do is this this resistor here, as you can see, the one that's uh, yellow, purple, and red, that's 4.7K, I think, working it out in my head, 4.7K resistor. What you need to do is put the probes of a multimeter either side of that resistor, across that resistor, and you need to measure 50 millivolts across that resistor. Um, if it's not 50 millivolts, if it's something like 10 millivolts or whatever, then you're going to get all sorts of problems reading with this. If you can get it exactly at 50 millivolts by adjusting uh, this here, 4K7 uh, trimmer there, it will, I guarantee, play all CDs. And uh, that is a really, really good fix for someone with one of these. So, yeah, there we go. This is now playing the uh, this CD. I can't play it for you, unfortunately. It sounds fantastic on this because I've modified this. And uh, this particular CD player will be advertised on eBay uh, very, very shortly for sale. Um, I've done the full, full mods on this and everything like that, full test and um, serviced it. And uh, so, yeah. This is, this is really good. So hopefully someone out there has really enjoyed this video and really got value from this video as well because this is a quite a big big thing in these really because these R-cams can be very fussy reading CDs. So uh, this should help quite a lot of people. Thanks very much for watching. Please like and subscribe. There'll be a lot more of these sort of videos coming up with CD players before I get an influx of musical instruments coming in and then the the videos will change uh, somewhat for a while anyway but I'm remaining on CD players, high-end CD players uh, that's one thing that I'm gonna carry on with anyway thanks very much for watching please like and subscribe please add a comment and I'll see you in the next one